Good morning students. Now it's time to learn environmental studies. So, are you ready for it? Yes? Okay, then let's start. Students, today we will start the fourth chapter of class 5 environmental studies, food for plants. In this chapter, we will learn how do plants get their food. If we talk about green plants, they can make their own food with the help of non-living substances of nature. But animals and human beings cannot make their own food. They are directly or indirectly dependent on plants for their food. In the next chapter, Animal Life, we will discuss how animals and human beings are dependent on plants for their food. In today's lecture, we will discuss how do green plants get their food. As we know that green plants can make their own food and they make their food through the process of photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a process in which a plant make their own food with the help of water, carbon dioxide and sunlight in the presence of chlorophyll. So now let us discuss the process of photosynthesis in TT. First, we will understand where do green plants get all the material required for the process of photosynthesis. First, water. The roots of the plant observe the water from the soil. They send the water to the stem and then stand, stand that water to the leaves. Okay. Now, second is carbon dioxide. As we know that carbon dioxide carbon dioxide is present in the air, there are small holes on the surface of the leaf from where the air and carbon dioxide enters inside the plant. Now, third, sunlight. As we all know that sunlight comes from sun. And here comes the role of chlorophyll. The chlorophyll traps this sunlight for the process of photosynthesis. Now, sunlight is required for the process of photosynthesis as a energy. Why? Because making food is a kind of work for which energy is required. So, for the energy purpose, for the processing of food, the sunlight is required as a form of energy okay now as we know that all these things are going inside the leaf so the process of photosynthesis takes place in the leaf okay now in this process of photosynthesis the plants make their food oxygen and water vapor. They release the oxygen and water vapor to the external environment which is later used by human beings or other animals for the, their survival. We know that we need oxygen to breathe. So, from where this oxygen, oxygen come to our atmosphere? It comes through plants after the completion of process of photosynthesis. Hope now the process is clear to you. Students, this was your lesson for today. Hope it is clear to you and you enjoyed it a lot. Next time I will bring you a new video. Till then, take care. Goodbye.